Hello, Jill here on day eight of the 30 day social media content posting challenge. Thank you, Brian Henry. Picking up on my theme of trust and surrender from yesterday, I think that was a theme. Not entirely sure, but I'm going to go with it. Yeah, today, so just kind of going with what happened during the day. I don't know what else I got to share with you. I'm not anything special and I'm not even really sure why I'm doing this but I feel called to come on here and just share some glim some glimpses so today I was talking with one of my my good friends and we were sharing you know some of our thoughts about what's going on in society our own struggles mental health processes things that have supported our journey and so we were going back and forth about she's more um, immersed in more traditional the mental health systems and um, yeah, and I've kind of gone the more alternative route. Uh, both have dealt with, you know, heavy, you know, traumatic situations and just kind of comparing notes. And um, my first instinct was to feel a little defensive, like, oh, I just don't want to hear about the, the mental health system because I've just had such a bad experience. I just, you know, it just didn't work for me. The therapist just couldn't understand the, the lived experience that I had. So it was really frustrating. Um, I kind of had to go it alone. And I, you know, as I've shared, cannabis has been a part of my journey. Um, plant medicine really um, enabled me to do a lot of my own kind of uh, my own healing. I'm not saying I didn't have supports, but um, lots of tools along the way. But that was a big, you know, window of opening for me. And it was so... Um, judged by the the mental health system and I was in this addiction counseling training program when I was kind of going through this like awareness that I needed to really process some traumas and whatnot so um, anyways I have this little little bit of resentment towards it but um, as I've like evolved I guess just not judging myself for it and also respecting um, all tools no matter what it is I think today things are tough for a lot of people, there's a lot of change, um, and you know I'm not going into that, but so you know whatever tools we're, we're using, I think it's just it's not about the tools, it's about us, it's about just preserving our unique ex ex expression, and I feel like sometimes that does get lost in the mental health system where we're more of a diagnosis and, um, oh yeah, am I still here? Yeah, I guess I am. Uh, whoopsie, yeah. So we're more of a diagnosis, and it's it just seems like we we lose that unique, authentic, energetic expression sometimes with all the um, labeling of things and whatnot. But um, so going off the off the range a little bit personally, but also like the awareness that we need more help, we need support, we need to support each other. Actually, I really believe that we can help ourselves, though. That's you know. There's, it, there, we always want hands to hold, you know, but we can, we can go inward and we have the answers within, um, connected. We are divine beings and we have resources beyond belief. So, um, also knowing that a lot of people don't necessarily see things that way. And, you know, pe if people are hurting, you know, whatever helps, I feel like right now, let's just not judge ourselves. Because I think the minute that we start to judge ourselves, we really kind of ground it in. We hold ourselves to the past. And whatever's helping you get through the day. You know, obviously, let's not be self-destructive. But, um, you know, even if that's what's happening, then just own it and walk through it. And, and stop judging yourself because there's probably a freaking good reason why. And that's, uh, that's the other thing. We all have such, um, so many variables, so many unique um, challenges that no one knows about and we're all trying the best we can uh, on many levels even if we're not even aware consciously we're doing our freaking best so that's my little uh, talk for you all today um, yeah I think uh, yeah I'm looking down because I did kind of write something out but um, yeah I'm kind of going on yeah I guess, you know, I looked down at my desk and I was going to start judging myself for not doing enough today. And I was like, I've got shit all over the place. I've got piles of this. And I look and I think about what I did. And even though it didn't really add up to much, it was like I had a million little brush fires to put out. 
And so, like, give myself a break. So what, I didn't, you know, accomplish this great thing or um, whatever. Whatever. Just loving it for what it is. So thanks, anybody, tuning in. I love y'all, and uh, thanks for watching. Thanks, Jenny.